Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Modesty33 here, AKA Crystal with the C. Back at you with another video, but if you're new to my channel, you just happen to click on. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I try to put out um, one or two videos a week. I do sit downs, reviews, reactions, vlogs. So if any of that interests you, make sure you check out my prior videos on my channel. And if you see anything you like, before you leave, make sure you subscribe. So today, you guys, um, by request, I'm gonna be doing the trailer reaction for Stranger Things season three. Oh, I'm super excited. I think um, I, w I try not to read too much and I try not to like really go and do searches and all, but I believe um, I did see something a while back that um, this season three would be premiering um, like 4th of July, I think, um, of this year, 2019. So I'm really, really excited about that. Stranger Things is definitely by far my favorite um, series uh, that I got into last year, I believe. I know I did reactions last year. So, and I got my family into it and some of my friends. So yeah, we're all really anticipating season three. Super duper excited to see what goes on with the kids, see what's happening in the 80s and just to take that journey again. So um, I'm gonna be going ahead and doing the trailer reaction today. I have not seen it. I really actually was not going to look at it until someone asked last week on my channel if I was gonna do the trailer reaction. I was like, okay, well, why not? I did look at the last, um, I do remember watching last season's trailer, which was really awesome, very well done. So really excited about this trailer. So I'll go ahead and get into it, guys, and I will be back um, at you guys on the other side with my review and observations of what I'm expecting and anticipating for season three. Bye, guys. Okay, got the record player, the boom box. Well, not the record player, it's a boom box. A little turtle. At least someone's happy I'm home. At least you ain't got no demigorgons up in there. Dustin, that's my boy. Okay. It's just a dream. You're dreaming. He got, he got the Steve Harrington hairspray, the fair faucet. Oh, look at 11. Welcome home, Dustin. <laughs> oh my God, he got Lucas right in the eyes with the Steve Harrington spray. Okay, come through music. Hawkins Post. Saw my boy. That's Jonathan. Oh, we got him again. Oh. Okay, Hopper. We're not kids anymore. They're not kids anymore. I mean, what did you think? We're just gonna sit in my basement all day, play games for the rest oh, of our lives. Will. This can still be your home. Oh. 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 Happy Fourth of July! What the heck? children are you friends with oh no don't don't make my boy out Steve to be like that nah he just friendly he just friendly y'all know I love Steve all right you guys so so um yeah that's a trailer reaction for season three stranger things so um 
It was a lot of different things in that trailer. I don't think, I'm gonna go ahead and say off front, like I don't think that this trailer was as good as last season's trailer when they put it to like the Michael Jackson Thriller music. I thought that was a really good trailer. But you know, this was still a really good trailer. I would of course have to watch it again and kind of catch some more things. But just as far as my first impressions, I feel like from this particular trailer, um, I'm of course still excited about season three. I think it's going to be awesome. I think the Duffer brothers are going to knock it out the park. Um, I don't know what the angle is really going to be for season three, but what I did notice about this trailer, it looks like they they might introduce more political elements of that season. And that time you did see kind of like the protesters, um, you see where, um, so I did see that element of it. So I'm kind of intrigued by that as far as how that's going to be handled as far as the supernatural elements of the storyline so you did see that they did kind of touch on that a little very briefly in season two where you did see that dustin's mom had like the poster in her yard um i don't remember what what it what it actually said but i do remember that but um, I think it's going to be touched on more in this particular um, season. So that'll be interesting to see how that's intermingle intermingle because you did again see the protesters. Um, another thing that I noticed is that you do see where the dynamics between the kids are changing because again, they're hitting puberty and um, it looks like, you know, of course they're a little bit older, especially as you see Mike. Mike is like really tall. So, you know, the kids of course have grown and they're kind of coupling up and you see where they're developing relationships and how relationships are changing. So that's going to be an interesting dynamic because again, when we started off season one, these were kids who were playing Dungeons and Dragons in the basement. Now they have other priorities, you know, so they're growing up. Steve looks like he's gotten a job at the mall doing different things. And so it's kind of interesting to see like where all the kids are, what they're doing. And even like, you know, it looks like there's still some stuff going on with Will. And then there's still, of course, stuff going on with Eleven as far as the supernatural element is concerned. So I couldn't catch like everything in that trailer, but you did see Hopper. Um, you know, it looks like, you know, you see little elements of everybody where you see where they're trying to move on. Didn't see that much of Joyce and like, so I kind of still get the sense that she may still be in the zone of protective mom in this season. And maybe something will happen where, or it's going to be kind of as far as her character arc, as far as her living her life beyond everything that's happened or trying to, it looks like Hopper may be kind of doing that as well. Like you see him, he's in like, looks like a little bar smoking a cigarette. So it looks like maybe he's trying to move on and Joyce isn't quite at that place where she's ready to move on or is she struggling to move on? You did see Murray Bowman, um, who is that really, um, yeah, eccentric reporter guy in season two. So that'll be interesting seeing him back. Um, what else did I notice that kind of, you know, jumped out at me? Of course, they are alluding to the supernatural elements with Eleven. You saw somebody, something was going on with their skin. Looks like they were infected. Um, Will was in the basement sweating. Um, I did see that. And then, of course, at the end, you saw that big monster, which looks like a mutated demigorgon times 22 so i don't know you guys i'm really excited to see but i think this season is going to be so much more complex than the other two seasons because again it looks like they are introducing the political elements as well as just kind of life in general growing up and how their changes in relationships again mike makes that statement you know we're not little kids anymore so we're not just going to be in the basement so that will be very interesting. So those are my all of my observations from this trailer. Um, I did really enjoy it. It's good to see that Dustin is still using the Steve Harrington Fair Faucet Spray and that him and Steve look like they're still close. <laughs> and hopefully Steve finds himself a little girl. You know, I love Steve. As long as Steve don't die season three, we cool. And we did see, that was the other thing. We saw Max's stepbrother. So I wonder if he's going to play a bigger role too. Looks like he's a lifeguard at you know, this pool or whatever. I did notice that. So, um, looks like maybe we might delve more into Max and Billy, I think is his name, like their kind of story or their dynamics and see kind of what was going on more with that. I don't know you guys, but, um, yeah, that's everything that I noticed. Let me know what you guys, um, thought about this trailer below. Um, what did you notice? What are you excited about for season three? 
I don't have like any other predictions besides what I just stated, like what I saw from the trailer as far as the direction that the Duffer Brothers are going to go into. So um, what did you see from the trailer? What are your predictions? Comment below. But if you enjoyed this video, this reaction to the trailer season three of Stranger Things, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure you do share this with anyone else who likes trailer reactions and is really excited about season three of Stranger Things. Also, again, make sure you do subscribe to the channel. You do that by hitting the red button below and hitting the bell next to it so you're notified when I do upload future videos. So again, thank you so guys. Thank you so much for watching you guys. I really appreciate it. I will see you in my very next video. Bye.